At this current moment, it's time to get Monday drunk. Monday, oh, I was, oh Monday. boy. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. I forgot to tell you, I shook yours up. Good pour. <laughs> not bad though. No, no, I mean, it could be worse, but it's not great. I'm trying to be a supportive friend over here. And the one told you life was gonna be this way. What do we have today? Today, Scorched Earth Brewing Company's Hey Chicago, what do you say? German style Hellas. Pilsner, Munich, Haller Tower, Mitten, Middle Fra Hops. Jeez, I don't know anything about beer. I'm realizing that's the good. That's the good hops right there. Yeah, we had this what two weeks ago on the show. And yeah, this yeah, comes yeah. in a uh, four pack. So today is the end of the four pack. Mittelfrau, pull it down. I need my Mittelfrau hops. Yeah, I'll have another one of those. <laughs> Very. Uh, we liked it two weeks ago, and I'm gonna be honest with you guys, it's just as good as it was then. So good. <laughs> and then Corey, we have three sauces here today, all from the same company, but what are we rocking with? Yeah, we're doing the little Hoff special today. Hoff is one of my all, both of our all-time favorite hot sauces. Uh, he ranks highly on my list. Yeah. We're gonna start off with their house sauce, but in a, similar to the German uh, style beer, we're doing house as the German house. It's house. H-A-U-S. Love it. So this is their house sauce. <laughs> Become a Zitatsu. <laughs> and it's their, your everyday hot sauce. <laughs> yeah. And also shout out to Aha uh -huh for uh, sending these to us. It's really cool. Get out of the house! Get out of the house! Name it bring friend! Name it bring America! <laughs> you won't find a review of these sauces quite like this one. <laughs> Let's get into it. I think this sauce, Corey, is currently on hot ones. Get out of the house! <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Wow. Oh, very quick. Yeah. What is that instantly? There's something. A lot of good spices. I'm getting like a, whoa, that is so distinct. What the hell am I tasting? Where are you hiding these spices? Yeah! Clover honey. Black. Are these spices in the attic? Are these spices in the attic? Black mustard seed. You are crossing the line! Wow, that is so good kick. Fucking good. Mm-hmm. Wow. That is, yeah, really good kick. Wow. I wonder if they put these pe peppers in the oven! We put the peppers in the oven! I don't even know what the neighbor complaint would say. I think someone's yelling in German and is mad at someone. I don't, oh, that's so good. I'm pretty sure I could just show them my uh, mom's 23 and me where we found out that uh, she's like 98.6% German and they just go, I guess this is just what we live next to. can't say anything now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's the second one here today? Next up, we've got Hoff's Wake Up Call Hot Sauce. This is with the delicious kick of Frothy Monkey Cold Brew Coffee. Whoa, Frothy Monkey? That's monkey <laughs> if I ever heard it. Frothy monkey? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know how they throw their sh Yeah, yeah. Do they throw their sh too? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, they got you. Sorry. Mm -hmm. That's a very good question, but if I could say something first. I was very fascinated by that. That's awesome, they just use it as a weapon. Right? All right, here we go. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. God damn it. That is so tasty. Holy sh! Both of these are really tasty. I like this taste a little bit better. It's got a little less heat. This taste is great. It's got a little more heat. We did the like lineup of these years ago, and we've stayed in touch with them and kind of had some of them here and there. He just keeps getting better. These mm -hmm. sauces are so full of flavor. There's just something about his stuff. The thickness is always great, and there's more flavor per like ounce of the sauce or like minuscule part of the sauce. It's flavor packed. I, it's flavor packed. Like how you can pack a bunch of people to hide in an attic, you know? And just pack up all the flavor up in there, you know? Where's the flavor? Show me the flavor! Paul found the flavor. <laughs> Coffee, cane sugar, garlic, curry, habaneros. That is so, dude, I don't know which one of those two I like better. This might be one of those rare occasions at the end of this video, I'm gonna do a drive-by and have both. Yeah, that's a good one. I'm gonna move. see, we'll see, maybe this one will take the cake though. Are you yeah, what do we got last year? The last one, okay, this is super awesome. For the anniversary, the fifth anniversary of Hoff and this sauce, the rise of smoke and ghost, he did, I think, a thousand, maybe, color bottles, because it was originally in color, and then when you start mass producing, you gotta cut costs, and then you did black and white. And so we got this incredible, like, box with the whole story, and then it came with a comic book. So this is one of the only bottles of Hoff smoke and ghost in full color. How sleek and sexy is that, dude? Damn. I'm excited for this. Yeah, dude, pirate. It's a pirate with a backstory. Sure is. And uh, as you can probably guess, we saved the hottest one for last. Cheers. Cheers. 
Mmm, dude. Still good flavor with the heat. So good. And I like where they went with the heat. Me too. That's not to the too appropriate much. level. Yeah, it's not the like burn your butthole out. It's flavor and then it's there, but it's still so flavor forward. Yeah, it's creeping up on me a little bit. Wow, I'm definitely yeah. getting a little sweat. This is great. Holy smokes, dude. I can't, I honestly right now have no clue which one I like the best. That never happens. Yeah, well, when you're dealing with Hoff, you're dealing with greatness. It really is. Hang his jersey in the top of the stadium already, dude. Retire that thing. Retire it, dude. Chattanooga. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and snag another plain wing and try this in a second. But first, guys, don't forget to like the video. Number six with cheese. Hi, that's us. Comes out with new videos every single weekday, 6 a.m. Eastern. They drop, you guys comment, you're fans of the show, it's a part of your daily lives, thank you. Subscribe if you're not a fan of the show already. Dude, that has, that's creeping up. Mm -hmm. Having a talk after. Mm -hmm. Slowly realizing why Hot Ones is the most genius thing of all time. What should the folks comment here today on the, on the episode? Do you have anything good that makes sense? I can't. I think we already did like which ingredient in a hot sauce is like a deal breaker for you. I don't know if we did what's like a thing traditionally in the hot sauces that you love. Yeah, let's do that. That's a good one. I don't think we've done that either. Because that one had curry mm. and I love curry and hot sauces. Yeah, stuff. I love, I love, and stuff. <laughs> yeah. I love turmeric. All right, so today, what is a hot sauce ingredient that traditionally is just your your full guns blazing, dude. You love it. If that if the hot sauce has this in it, you're more than welcome gonna you're more than likely gonna love it. Comment that here today. I think curry's probably mine. I think mine's garlic. Yeah. I can't wait to hear people's. I hope Hoff watches this video and then he comments because he's like the highest rung of, of a talent in this world. I'd love to know what he loves. Yeah, dude. He's a G. I know. I'd stroke him. Would you do it like with like a German accent? Out of respect. <laughs> Show me a penis! <laughs> he is of no concern to you. Donation channel, donation channel, donation channel. Here at Number Six for Cheese, you guys, the fans, make this show possible. You're the reason this has been running for five years, and it's because of donations and just things you guys have done for us on the show. We have a PayPal and we have a Venmo, so you can literally shoot us stuff for uh, to help pay for the meals, the gas, the um, new shirts and website costs, all the things that we do to make this show run cost money, unfortunately. And so when you guys help it run, we feel a lot more at ease. So if you'd like to drop a donation, you always get a shout out. As of today, we don't have any because we're caught up at the present time of filming this, but that doesn't mean that if you donate, you're not gonna be one of the next shout outs. So make sure to do that. Thank you to everybody who has donated. And my mouth's on fire. <laughs> it's not like I was like holding uh, two inches of water in the bottom of my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Moment of truth. Moment of truth. Uh, Eric McCloskey. Toledo's finest. Terminal, please. Thank you, sir. All right, on the count of three, pick your fi Oh, I, I lied to the people. I gotta do one quick. I oh, yeah, to tell which one's the best. Like, then it was a tough one. Do you need a little? No, that's probably good. I think I'd be good. I think it's just like, I'm, I think I'm kind of, I just wanna be sure. Because it's yeah. off, you know? I think I know what that one will need. These uh, wings stop boneless wings. Do not wait. These boneless chicken is amazing. Okay. Mmm, mmm, mmm. We like never do this. Like this is how like exciting this one was. Mm. That's so tough. Toss up. This one's so good too though. Okay, I think I know. Feeling it? I think I know. Oh man, he's been playing the drums for a while. Come on, guys. Or just like like Brutus? Is that Popeye's? Because Popeye had good forearms. What was the guy that was deep, wanted to take his girl? Bang. Yeah, what was his name? Was it like was Brutus? It <laughs> There's only room for one great sailor in this world. Hmm, that's me. All right, ready? Yeah. One, two, three. I like these both almost equally. I know. They're both so flavorful. I yeah. only went with this one because it's just a, this is like the perfect amount of heat for me. Yeah. This is mm. where it's a little elevated, but not too much. Yeah. It was the curry. Interchangeable though. It was I know. These. I wouldn't be mad if like I had, if you got that one and I got this one or I got, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I'm kind of totally fine. Um, I think so it was great. the curry and it was the monkey <laughs> in this one. Yeah, monkey <laughs> gets it, gets mm -hmm. it going. I didn't realize that Chattanooga, Tennessee was known for monkey <laughs> coffee. Yeah, well, you learn something new every day. I know, this show is kind of like a Wikipedia page. You don't, you don't gotta read anything though. You can just, we'll tell you the facts. Yeah, we're for non-readers. That's, <laughs> that's our main demographic. Yeah, absolutely. The dumb. <laughs> the dumb. <laughs> Guys, seriously, we don't get paid for uh, the Hoff stuff, but if you're looking for like a roundup of sauces that is incredible, go check this out. 
We'll toss the link of Hoff in the description of this video. That's how much Always we Always on the top of my head. There's them, I agree. Chef Iron Mike, mm -hmm. and uh, who's the Detroit? Scotty O'Hadi. Scotty O'Hadi. Yeah. Are my, those are my top three mm -hmm. all time favorite hot sauce connoisseurs and, and makers. These guys are amazing. Yeah. And then Sauce Bay for me is on that list too. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hope you enjoyed this video. We'll see you tomorrow for a brand new episode. New episodes every weekday, like we said. Uh, Hoff, once again, thank you. This is amazing. And uh, sure, I'll have a drink. Cheers. Suck the monkey shit out of the can.